Tragically and sadly, the people of the Arctic are on the front lines of this thing called climate change. Photograph I took in the northernmost community in the world, Kanak in northwest Gre Greenland, the only place in the Arctic where the people remain devoted to their dogs. And there the ice traditionally came in in September and is gone by July. Now it comes in November and it's gone by March. And when I wrote the Massey Lectures and they slapped on the subtitle, Why Ancient Wisdom Matters in the Modern World, I had to answer the question. I did so implicitly throughout the text, but at the end I really had to answer it, and I answered it with two words, climate change. Not to suggest that any of us go back to a pre-industrial past or that anybody in the world be denied the genius of the modern age, but rather to suggest the very existence of these other ways of being, these other realities, the other interpretations of life itself, put the lie to those who say there are no options. Put the lie to those who say that we cannot change as we all know we must change the fundamental way we interact with the world.